welcome back guys you are listening to siva khoya let's learn something new today in this episode i will show you how to create a colorful image and pin it on top of a people soft fluid tile all right let's get started before we jump ahead let's understand what image format people soft supports for this purpose the answer is svg scalable vector graphics i know your next question would be why not jpeg and png from what i understood both png and jpeg they store image data pixel by pixel they might lose some of those pixels during the compression process which they do behind the scenes because of this quality of image is not maintained when we scale the image up and down maybe that is the reason oracle doesn't want this to happen specifically with fluid as people soft automatically adjust the size of the image based on the device size all right that's about jpeg and png and what's the deal with svg images in svg format are defined in color codes and numbers if you want to increase the size of the image it's almost similar to multiplying a number color code remains the same so is the quality of the image let's take a look at this example using this simple xml code we can create rectangular shaped image in svg format you can see the color codes and numbers ideally speaking we should be creating svg images using xml coding unfortunately i do not have any skill set to show you how to create a complex image nor i could find any website where we can download svg images for free hence today i want to show you a quick and dirty way to work around this problem my plan is to create a colorful png image using a online tool and later we are going to convert that png format image into svg format before we jump ahead and create our png image we need to know what size or dimensions people soft recommends for our image we can find that out in people soft fluid ux standard guide this is the url i will share this link in the description below here you can see people soft recommends 80 by 80 for our home page tile now is the time to create our custom image in order to do that i will head to canva.com i navigated to canva.com you need to create a free account i already have created one so i logged into my free account in order to create design i will click on create a design since we had custom dimensions i clicked on custom dimensions based on people soft recommendation i will use 80 by 80 then i will click on create new design now i will select elements located on the left hand menu here you can search for your icon based on your context in my case i will type finance here you can see both free and paid icons if you select the icon you can see whether it is free or paid pro means paid so i would pick the very first one after selecting the icon i can drag the image so that it fits well within the canvas i think this looks good once i am happy with the positioning i will click the download button located in the top right hand corner and by default it is png i will keep it as is now i'll click on download button this is the image i downloaded from canva uh, let me give it some name finance icon the next step is to convert this image into svg format in order to do that i have navigated to this website a convert.com i tried few other websites for some reason nothing worked except this one to convert into svg format the process is pretty straightforward click on choose files and upload our png file i would select finance icon all i need to do is click on convert now we can find our conversion results just below click on download icon again click on the file url and save our svg file this is the svg file i just downloaded let me give a meaningful name the next step is to import this svg file into our people soft system there are two ways we can do this task the very first one is by logging into app designer and the second one is by logging into pia let me show you the usual way usual way is 
by logging into app designer click file new and select image click ok by default it selects jpeg but we need to select svg files select our file and click on open button next we need to name our image definition for this demonstration i am not going to upload using app designer instead i will show you through pia in order to do that navigate to people tools portal branding and select branding objects navigate to image tab and here you can click on upload image object and let's give some name and we need to select the image type i will select svg and we need to select our image i will select finance.svg now i'll click on upload give some description here and i will click save button that's it our file is imported into people's soft system now i will navigate to the home page let's spin our beautiful image on this tile in order to do that i will navigate to people tools portal structure and content fluid structure and content fluid pages and i am selecting my home page and this is the content reference for our tile i will click edit i will navigate to fluid attributes and here i will select our image name if i click on the prompt button this matches our description i will click ok save if you navigate to our home page ta da now you can see our beautiful image on the tile that's my two cents guys hopefully this video is helpful for you that's pretty much about it for today guys for more interesting content don't forget to visit my channel i look forward for your feedback based on it i refine myself and try to come up with the content that adds value to your skill set through this video if you learn at least one or two new points i feel all my effort is well worth it hit that subscribe button if you want to follow my videos let's stay in touch thank you so much for watching until next time signing off siva koya your people soft partner